guys, what's up? This is Dragon Lord Rock 86 back again for another Ace Card Series tutorial. And this time, I'm going to show you how to play videos on your Ace Card 2i. And it's pretty simple, okay? What you're gonna need to do is go onto my website here, okay? Let me zoom in. Okay, now that we're zoomed in, what you want to do, first off, is click on this link that's on this tab that says Moon Shell for DS. Read the top, look at what the, I mean, follow what the picture says, and go to this link down here on the bottom. Uh, for some reason it's not clickable, probably because I highlighted the link. Uh, but anyways download that once you download that go back go down to the bottom here where it says video converting files for DS go in here okay what you're gonna wanna do now is I I'm gonna have to just I mean revise this but what you wanna do is download this readme text this readme txt file you want to download that after you download that you want to go to this link on the bottom this will take you to this to the program okay and after you have the program downloaded what you need to do let me right there we go is go on to the and onto the re, onto the program Okay, now, when you first start this program up, it states that you cannot, uh, down, I mean, convert full files, and there's a whole bunch of limits, and blah, 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 please buy the full version, blah, blah, blah. Well, you can buy the full version if you want, but I highly recommend you reading that readme text, txt file, the on my site first and then going through with what it says because if you don't you're not going to get whole videos all right to use this the readme basically states that the way you can the way you have to do this is here let me show you you have to disconnect from your internet provider that you that you're connected to you have to disconnect from the internet completely Wait for this little... Okay, now there's the X. I'm disconnected. Alright, what you do is... I think I have it open. Yeah, I do. You go to the readme file that you downloaded off of my site. Right here, it'll give you... You scroll down, and it'll tell you a name, and it'll give you a license number code that you can type in, which you can only use these offline. So, you have to be off the internet or they will detect it and uh, you won't be able to do it, basically. But, I'm not sure if this works yet. I mean, if this still works or not, because I've been connected to the internet since then and I haven't converted since this morning. But, really what you do is, it's very simple. You click Add. You scroll into your videos and you pick a video any format video open it and okay this will pop up a lot it'll say you're currently using the crack version in order to safeguard your legitimate rights better please buy the registered version you want to click buy later or it'll force you to buy it and you just, I mean, it just won't be good. Okay, now that you have your video uploaded, it'll tell you the basic name of the video. You can revise the wit, the name of the video to whatever you want. Okay, I revised the name to what I wanted it to be. You can do, you can fiddle with the video size if you want, but I per, I like it at the two five six times one forty four that it's on. Then just go down here and put the video quality and the audio, whatever that you want it on. 
and pick mono or stereo and then you press this little red button up at the top and it will convert your file it will take a couple minutes to do this so I'll just set this camera down if it doesn't fuck up on me damn it come on come on Alright, whatever. This will work anyways. See, it's already at 21%. It's, I mean, it's not that bad. It's pretty fast. Um, the video, just, just as a side note, the format that you need to have your video in is DPG format. And if you don't have it in DPG format, it will not read on your DS, it, nor will it show up depending... Well, if you have the settings set that way, it will show up. But it won't show up either any, anyway. But you need Moonshell to be able to watch the video in the first place, which I will get to that in a minute after this conversion is done. It's already at 57%, so it's not going to take but like a minute. Sorry, this is taking so long, guys. This is taking a little longer than expected. It's at 84% right now. Um, I guess, um, there's not, uh, that's 90% now, so there's no point on sure. Okay, I'll just wait for it to finish. <sighs> this camera would stay still. Alright, now it's done. Now, as soon as you start this, I mean, as soon as you start this program for the second, I mean, for the first time, automatically, automatically, it'll have your videos folder selected as the output destination. So, what you're going to want to do, I'll get back to the video in a minute, what you need to start on is your moon shell. Which, like I said, it won't start up unless you install Moonshell. Alright, this setup is what you need, okay? Down at the very bottom it says Setup. Alright, what you're going to want to do is pop in your micro SD card from your ACE card to I. And my micro SD card about flew across the room. Damn spring. Okay. My micro SD card is in the computer. Alright, what you gotta do is you click the setup button on your moon shell, okay? You, de you detect, uh, you put in whatever kind of language you want it to be English. Okay. Click OK. And then afterwards it'll tell you it'll show you where you want to put it. Automatically it'll have your removable disk selected as the default that it'll go to. That's where you want it to go. Okay. You want it to go to that removable, but once and once you click that it'll install and I believe all the folders go there. I'm not one hundred percent sure. If not you have to place all these folders in there manually, okay? But anyways, once your moon shell is installed and everything on your micro SD card, you go to your video folder that was the default output setting for your video you just converted, alright? Then you go to your micro SD card. If I was you, I would create a folder that uh, says video. See, I already got one. Click into that. And just drag it and drop the video. Okay. You can do this with movies or whatever. 
just as long as they're in DPG format. Okay, exit out of that, minimize that. Alright, let's take the, S the micro SD card out so I can show you that this is legitimate and that this isn't fake. Show you that it actually works and that it's not just some scam to fuck people over. Okay. Take my micro SD card out. Put it in my ace card. The ace card in my DS Lite. This will work on any f on any DS that the ace card 2i will work on. Not just DS Lite, but right now DS Lite's all I got that this works on since I have the updated firmware. Let me zoom the cam out, and we'll get started. Alright, here we go. Get into this. Micro SD card. Okay, make sure that moon shell... That moon shell point two... I mean, moon shell two point NDS is on the root of your card. I don't know if, I can't remember if it automatically when you install it if it goes there or not, but you want it there. That's where you want it to be. You click into it. And it, this little thing will pop up. You can adjust these settings, whatever you want. Click OK. OK. Then you can scroll here and go to your videos folder. Scroll down your list of however many videos you put in your video folder and press into it. My name is David Draymond. I sing for the band Disturbed. The video you are about to see contains a very sensitive subject, suicide. It is unfortunately a subject that is close to me, having dealt with an actual occurrence of it many years ago. If you or someone you know is in crisis or having thoughts of suicide, Please call the National Suicide Prevention Hotline at 1-800-273-8255. But yeah guys, that's basically how you do it. You can adjust volume settings on here. I mean, it goes past the volume that you could put on your DS that's on the external part of your DS. And, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe to me. There will be more Ace Card videos coming up. Catch you guys later.